Right, so we're back down here at Mile End. We're introducing the resident high handicapper, the OAP, my neighbour, Melvin, say hello. Hello. You're going to get ripped to shit for this. <laughs> Uh, we're gonna have a three hole match well. We're on the 16th of mile end, then the 17th, then the 18th. Three relatively easy holes, but three that can go very, very, very badly. So we'll start off with you off the team out, right. and we'll see how we get on. Shot a hole. Okay. Best of luck. Absolutely fine there, Mel. It'll oh, I've done the same as you, Mel. Yeah. Blast it out to the right. Oh, and it's a trip. So the two of us have done a bit of exploring here in the woods. Tricky one up here, Mel. About 160, 170, I believe. Could be good. Could be good. I'll be going for Mel. Seven iron. Seven iron, same as me. Good choice. Oh my god. god. Has it come back? No, well, you're safe there. There's nothing to worry about, is there? No. We'll see when we get up there, lad. Yeah. Got so Melvin's on. just found the rough. I think a pitching wedge just knocked on front of the green, really. You don't have to tack the pin, do you? No. got to sit I think Mel. No, back. It's this green. I've got, got the touch of a ball. <laughs> What's that? I've got the touch of a ball. A touch of a, I'm not even going to say it because I don't think I could put it on YouTube if it's what I wanted to say. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> but you'd be, you'd be banned. <laughs> yeah I'd be banned off it within days. Right so I found the bunker. I'll be honest Mel. You'd probably come back here. Yeah. Towards the Towards a bell, the bell and just rolled in. I'd prefer to be playing this out the bunker. Yeah. But they are GUR. They're, they're harder than the greens. <laughs> uh, so this has got a pitch just over the bunker. Uh, as good as it's going to get from there. That's a good one, Mel. It's got to sit, otherwise we're in the bunker. What were you saying? Oh, he's giving me the all. Oh, he's conceded. Do you know what, right? On the channel, I think you're the first person ever to concede the all. Oh, yeah. I think Ryan's took nine shots to get to the green before. He still won't concede the goddamn all. Because right, Ryan is a knobhead. <laughs> uh, lucky Mel. We'll go on to the I'm next. Play. I normally play a six iron here, but that's for winter. Right? Seven iron, nice and low. Keep it away from the pond. Yeah. And we should be all right. I'll set this up behind you. Mel's currently one down, coming onto the par three. Tricky one, downhill, sort of wind everywhere and over the pond. So could be losing. In 30 seconds time, Mel could be two down, but it goes wrong it's in the pond. <laughs> uh, yeah, and I'll be honest, I'll take a safe one if it does. <laughs> well, that's a coward's way out. Yeah, it is, yeah. Take your time, pre shot routine. Ooh, he's darted it towards a pond. Just short, Mel. I think we'll be chipping from there, pal. Yeah, that's chipping. Oh. Chipping in, yeah. <laughs> but I'm still trying to keep a card, Mel, so I'm not going to play it safe. I'm just going to try and hit the flag. Oh, that's a duff, but that will. That will follow mine. Oh, I tell you what, we might have worked from there. So I think the pressure's got hold of me a bit here. I'm trying to win after two holes. I haven't done that since I played Scott. So I've made it about halfway to the hole. I'm going to knock this. Still got, still got the advantage from here, I think. So I'm just going to play it right to the green. So Melvin just under the trees here. It's a tricky chip from here. Got to get it up and kind of stop it before it. I don't even know what he's got to do. I 
I think that's a safe play. Just over the other side. Yeah. Not a bad shot, Mel. Not oh. tying with the pond. Well, you're there for one, and I'm on the front edge for two, so certainly not bad. That's right, lads, you're fucking famous. <laughs> uh, but if, <laughs> hey, you'll be famous if you nail this square pass into the water as well, oh Mel. My God, yeah. We're both where we are for. What's you put? You put in for three, Mel, and I'm putting for three. But you got a shot on me as well, remember? So lagging this might be a good idea. Send it up the last. It's a good looking putt. Ooh, I think there's still work there, Mel. Yeah, there I think is. I'm gonna make you do it as well. Any other green? I think I'd give you that, but this green maybe not. So I've caught the front edge. Mel, I think getting a bit worried about possibly putting it off the other end of the green. It is quick, this one. So if this goes, Mel, I've got to, you've got to put that for a half. But this has got to go. <laughs> No. <laughs> just low. That'll be on. That's stronger there, isn't it? What's that? Just listen to me say no, isn't it? <laughs> yeah. Right, so you've got this for the windmill of the hole, or Too two far. for the half to send it up the last, regardless. <laughs> Lovely oh. putt. And lucky, you can have that one, Mel. It stays one up, Dormy going up the last. The touch of a ball strikes again. <laughs> so you got high hopes for this hole, Mel? I certainly have. One down going into the last. That is safe as houses. That's Middle of the fairway, probably about 150 in, Mel. Yeah, that, I can't believe I'll look at, I'll wait, how I got away with that then. I think as long as it's going sort of down the fairway, I think we can get away with a lot with how dry everywhere it is. Yeah. Just hoping I get away with this. And don't spew it out right like I did on the 16. Need a par to break 80, so well, a bogey to break 80, so we'll see how it goes. Just bleeding a bit. Safe as that is. shot. Should be a chip and a putt from there, hopefully. Right then, Mal, we've got 117 to the middle. You have got a shot on the hole. Yeah. So uh, you've got to win this one, so I think this one's got to be close. Yeah, Unless I shank one, it, it can happen. Will you stop putting me off? I'm sorry. I'm not enough, is. Oh, yeah, I'll come round here. <laughs> come round here, this. Don't do a massive, get out of the way. <laughs> get out my eye line. <laughs> Hopefully, he doesn't have YouTube. <laughs> I, I won't be for uh, Not true. Not <laughs> too much. But I'm not a very big hitter, as you well know. With a shot, Mel, that's really not a bad one. Keep going. A nice punch about, on now. Yeah, with about five yards. He could use his three iron for that, no doubt. Four. Four iron, there you go. As Four you're saying. 69 yards in, Mel. I'm gonna clean my 60, see if I can see any of the groove. I'm just gonna try and pitch one short, preferably. Ooh. Uphill putt for birdie. <laughs> Gonna show him how to chip. Huh? Must be talking balls this up. Oh, that's not bad, Mel. Oh, good shot. So I might have to make that one to force Mel to putt. I'm not there, my ball <laughs> Are we going to do? We're going to do it the old rules. That's what they used to do in the old days, Mel. Yeah, you could leave your ball where it was. It's like footage of people chipping it over. So I got this for birdie, which would mean I'm in in 79. Which means I will hit you for like ever. And I've also got to hold this to make you well. I got two putts actually. And uh, I haven't. This has got to go if I want to win for sure. Thanks, Mel. It's a birdie, and that's a 78. Piss off. Thank you. Cheating he is. 
YouTubers are cheeks. <laughs> YouTubers are cheeks. <laughs> uh, right, Mel's got a nice little oh, putt for par. I won't do this, like. He's one hand. But there again. Oh, there you I go. Might, might, I... Right, so Mel doesn't lose two up. He loses one down. Unlucky Mel. Yeah. But we'll give it a putt of touch in there. Yeah. Hey, one handed Sing. golf is the way to play, mate. One handed putting. So that's a good par, that Mel. Yeah, it was, eh? He's 30 handicapper, if anyone's interested to know. He's an absolute shark. I'm not. You lying sod. I it <laughs> that's a win for me. You can come more often. Yeah, I hate you. <laughs>